country well known for its culture and festivities carnivals football martial arts jiu jitsu capoeira five brings you to the national day of brazil here you can see hundreds of guests taking part in this festivity ladies and gentlemen let's become a part of this festivity The 194th Independence Day of Brazil was celebrated on September 26, 2016 at Islamabad. Chief guest Mia Muhammad Mansha, prominent Pakistani industrialist and entrepreneur, was invited as the chief guest. Ambassador of Brazil, His Excellency Claudio Lins and other dignitaries cut the cake and formally started the celebration. On this occasion, Mia Muhammad Mansha ensured full support to Brazil to increase bilateral trade and business opportunities. The event was attended by diplomats, businessmen, members of civil society and other VIP guests. The most unique part of the event was capoeira performance by the capoeira teachers and students at the Embassy of Brazil. So uh, guys, but now we have with this uh, the beautiful lady of the evening Mrs. Zu Lins. Madam first of all you were looking very beautiful. Thank you sir. Would you like to say a few words on this special day? Bom, estou muito feliz hoje comemorando a nossa data da independência. Desculpa porque eu tô muito suada porque não sei bastante e trabalhamos muito para que essa festa saísse legal e foi muito boa, está sendo muito boa. She is saying that she is very happy to have you here. She apologizes she is a bit dizzy because she has been dancing a lot. But she is very very happy that all the world all the work she devoted to this party meant that people are happy here. Okay, that's nice to have you here. Do you have any message for the audience of Fire on this beautiful day? Bom, é, estou muito feliz hoje aqui para a gente comemorando a data da independência juntamente com o Paquistão, né? Aqui está muito animado e quero chamar todo mundo para ir se divertir com a gente, que tem muita dança. Está igual a revista Fire, muito fogo. She saying that she's very happy uh, that the people here are in an excellent atmosphere. She is inviting you all to join us in the dance floor and she's saying that the atmosphere here is like a fire magazine lots of fire yes. thank you so much is excellent thank you so much mrs zu it's very nice to have you on fire thank you Gentlemen, now we have with us Mr. Mohammad Basim, who is the president of Bridging Trade International and who is also a member of European Economic Forum. Mr. Basim, thank you so much for being with us. Please tell us something about the bilateral trade between Pakistan and Brazil. Thank you very much. First of all, uh, I would like to say that uh, the ambassador uh, of Brazil is putting a lot of efforts to develop the trade between the both countries. and i recently we are based in central europe and uh, bridging trade is internationally is responsible to develop the trade between central european and eastern european countries i'm a member of european economic forum and also try to develop the relation with brazil so i recently opened my office in brazil and uh, de uh, to develop the bilateral trade between the both countries so i hope that with the support of uh, brazilian embassy and our embassy uh, in brazil in sao paulo we will develop the trade between the both countries we are already doing the fashion and trade shows so hopefully we will have some fashion shows in brazil and also over there in pakistan okay sir uh, do you think that you can facilitate for the future companies who are trying to import and export different items between different european countries 
Yes, sure. We are already doing this. We are working as a buying house. We bring the number of companies, renewed companies from Pakistan to Europe. I recently came from Kiev. I organize a very big conference over there. I bring uh, the people from Pakistan and also the, uh, we arrange the B2B meetings over there. So why not also with Brazil? Definitely we will do this. Sir, do you have any message on the special day of Brazil for our audience? Yes, I think that uh, Brazil is upcoming mar market and uh, the Pakistani exporters, they should focus to find out the opportunities and uh, we will also try to explore the opportunities and share with the Pakistani businessmen. Thank you so much sir for your time. It is really a pleasure to see you. Thank you very much. You people are also putting a lot of efforts and contribute in this, uh, I think, trade activities. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, Kepora is a very unique martial art of Brazil. And behind me, you can see the performance of Kepora at the National Day of Brazil. So we have Sh Mr. Shafiq Swati, who is the president of um, the Human Rights NGO for the Empowering Society. So Mr. Uh, Shafiq, um, how do you find the event since we are at the Brazilian event? How did you enjoy it? How do you like it? Obviously, it was a wonderful event. You know, as, as everyone uh, has experienced, this, this is unusual event as compared to other events. It's a very colorful and uh, I must add one thing that Ambassador His Excellency Mr. Claudio Lins and his wife, gorgeous wife, uh, Zoe Lins, are wonderful couple in this town. We are blessed that these uh, diplomats are here and uh, beside of this, their cooperation always very kind towards uh, good causes like what we are doing uh, for the promotion and protection of human rights and uh, they are very much kind in, uh, kind enough. Uh, uh, I have no words to explain. And if you have uh, listened his speech, and he has uh, extended so many kind kind words for me for my organization, I'm really grateful for uh, of him. So basically, his contribution towards the society and towards your N uh, NGO is uh, a lot. It's it's enormous. It's enormous. And uh, again. Because you know, uh, financial support is nothing. That 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 worth something. But at at time, the, if you are having a sport uh, morally like this, and uh, especially of uh, the person like uh, Mr. His Excellency Claudio Lins, I am very much honored. Honored. I have no words to express. Thank you so much. These are some Bye. really sweet remarks from you. Thank you so much. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, now we have with us Mr. Shiraz Kasuri, who is a lawyer and who is participating in the National Day of Brazil. Sir, how do you see the role of His Excellency Mr. Claudio Lins in bringing the two countries together? Well, Assalamu alaikum. Uh, I personally feel that Mr. Claudio Lins, the ambassador of Brazil, is doing a great job in bringing Pakistan and Brazil together. And uh, he's a very dynamic personality. So, do you think that he will be bringing the two countries together in future? Definitely, because uh, Brazil has a lot to offer to Pakistan. Brazil is one of the biggest countries in South America. And uh, it's a very upcoming second world country and uh, very close to be a first world country. And uh, recently the visit of uh, General Rahil Sharif of Pakistan to Brazil and meeting the COS in Brazil uh, shows that Pakistan and Brazil can not only exchange in militarily but also economically. So I think Pakistan and Brazil have a lot to learn from each other. Do you have any message for the audience of FIRE on this special day? Well, definitely I would like to wish Brazil all the best in their future endeavors. They are not only a world force in soccer or football, but they are a world force also economically. So all the best to Brazil. Thank you so much, sir. Gentlemen, now we have with us Mr. Tanzeen Akhtar, who is the editor of Pakistan in the World. So, Mr. Tanzeen, I would like to ask you the role of the investors in Pakistan. What is the basic role? Like, how are they, the Brazilian investors contributing towards the society of Pakistan? Yeah, look, uh, Brazil is a very important country of the world. 
and uh, if you see uh, the new countries emerging uh, with respect to economy uh, brazil is one of the most important country and uh, brics brics is a platform uh, that include brazil india russia uh, germany and other uh, china and other uh, countries that are emerging markets of the world brazil is very keen to develop uh, diplomatic and uh, different uh, cooperation in different sectors of uh, sector uh, different sectors with pakistan uh, i see that brazil and pakistan can uh, move forward uh, in energy in uh, uh, culture in sports and uh, if we, if we talk about sports our uh, different players has uh, uh, contributed in the recent rio rio olympics and performed very well brazil is a uh, develop diplomatic ties with pakistan when pakistan was uh, came into existence in 1947 In 1951, Brazil uh, established the diplomatic relations. Uh, Pakistani embassy is working there in Buenos Aires and in uh, 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 other parts of uh, Brazil. Many Pakistanis are uh, working there. Uh, we should uh, develop uh, people-to-people contacts with with Brazil, like you have seen uh, Capora. their uh, an uh, art and culture uh, thing capora uh, our two players have played very well uh, they have also participated in the olympics uh, uh, for uh, capora and confirm very well so is there any message that you would want to give on this occasion uh, i will give the message that brazil is very Brazil is far with uh, respect to distance but with respect to hearts our hearts beat together Pakistan and Brazil both nations uh, they feel for each other they love each other and we have uh, many prospects many possibilities that uh, we can develop our uh, relation uh, our bilateral relations in energy sector there is a huge potential yes thank you so much for your time thank you gentlemen now we have with us mr asad rafi ceo micronox the second largest it company thank you so much sir for joining us thank you sir rish so how do you feel on this special day of brazil being a participant being a businessman how do you see the future prospects of brazil and pakistan uh, first of all i want to congratulate the embassy of brazil the people of brazil on this uh, 149th independence day Uh, I feel privileged right to be a part of this wonderful event that has been hosted by His Excellency Claudio Lins right and I want to congratulate him as well for hosting such a nice event and I believe right that Pakistan and Brazil has uh, quite a charm when it comes down to business when it comes down to trade and I wish both of the countries best of luck right for future and for the prospects which are going to be beneficial for both of the countries So you are also going to organize the National Capoeira Festival in December. So can you please brief us about the festival? Oh yes, thank you Sarish for highlighting this, right? Uh Micronox is uh, which is the official event management company for the Embassy of Brazil in Islamabad is actually going to host a wonderful program for uh, the most unique martial arts which is called capoeira, right? The the program is going to be held in the second week of december right and with the help of 
fire i want to invite everyone right to come and join and be a part of that magnificent event right for the event capoeira sir as a businessman what future prospects do you see between the two countries when it comes to trade when it comes to import export and when it comes to production i think so both of the countries are actually focusing on strengthening their relationship when it comes down to business terms especially either importing stuff from pakistan or exporting right from brazil i believe right that both of these countries have got a diverse culture right and i think so we have got huge potential when it comes down to rice exports when it comes down to leather exports sports already we are doing that uh, through football and with the blend of information technology which is going to be the new dimension between brazil and pakistan i think so this relationship is going to become more strengthened because of the blend of so many diversified business ventures that are coming in so we highly appreciate your business plans and we wish you all the best for future thank you so much for your time thank you sarish and thank you fire gentlemen now we have with us mr safid hussain shah who is a lawyer and editor of weekly electoral times sir how do you feel on this auspicious occasion of brazil national day actually uh, brazil is a nice country and uh, they have a very good uh, reception and also the uh, different thing is that the music and dance and this is their own uh, uh, introduction in their country but uh, the other hand is a very good uh, democratic country and uh, maybe you know that their number of votes and our pakistani number of votes votes are almost equal uh, match matchable and uh, they have used very uh, excellent uh, uh, electronically voting machine which is uh, uh, they 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 conclude their result within 2 3 hours so this is the my subject but this is uh, a wonderful reception sir how do you see the relations of pakistan and brazil in the next 3 years uh, actually uh, pakistan and brazil have a very good business relation also uh, very good uh, bilateral relation so they day by day improving uh, the bilateral relation sir uh, do you have any message for fire viewers on this special day actually uh, fire magazine is a very good effort and uh, particularly your uh, fire tv the uh, net tv is a new idea and uh, is also very easy to approach and to communicate uh, with the pupils and with the uh, on the social media as well and also on uh, by magazine and by uh, tv channels so it's very good to have you on fire tv thank you so much Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, guys, we are here uh, at the Brazilian event, and now we are going to introduce you to Mr. Nasser Chaudhary. And um, Mr. Nasser, you, uh, Mr. Claudio Lins, ka kya kirdar dekhte hain uh, diplomatic society mein? Dekhe hain investor ka bada hai ki ham role hota hai jaise ek zindir ke saath zindir jodi hoti hai. To inhone hamare Pakistan ke andar bahut bade project shuru kiye hain. हमारे आवाम के लिए हमारे बिजनेस मैनों को भी चाहिए कि जाएं और विजिट करें इनके साथ जो बिजनेस मौाक़े हैं उनके बारे में डिस्कस करें आ, आप इन पाकिस्तान और ब्राज़ील का रिलेशन कैसा देखते हैं पाकिस्तान और ब्राज़ील का रिलेशन कैसा देखते हैं रिलेशन माशाल्लाह बहुत अच्छा है रिलेशन मजीद बढ़ेगा थैंक यू और कोई मैसेज आप देना चाहेंगे तो ये देना चाहता हूँ कि सबको अपने हम सारे मुल्कों के साथ तमाम ये बढ़ानी चाहिए विद कैमरा मैन आइज दिस इज सैरिश कंवल फाइव टीवी इस्लामाबाद